Hello everyone, it's Mitch from Shockmail's News, where we take the news that was too long and you didn't read and give it to you straight. Fellow Australian and fellow Novocastrian, Isaac Butterfield tonight announced he was summoned by the Queensland Human Rights Commission after a single person filed a complaint. The complaint details that this person, this one person, took offence to a TikTok Isaac posted of one of his stand-up shows in Perth from last January. In it, he told jokes about Aboriginal people. Isaac was due to appear before the Human Rights Commission on April 20 in Queensland. However, he chose not to appear as this date was within days of his first child due to be born, and the commission is in a different state to where he resides. If he is found to have committed any wrongdoing, it isn't exactly clear how harsh the penalty, if any, will go. I don't even know what happens here if I'm found in the wrong. <laughs> but in the complaint, when asked, what outcome would you like to resolve your complaint, the complainant listed apology and training. Isaac has said he refuses to apologize for telling jokes because they are just jokes. The one person who made the complaint now has 28 days to respond, or the file will be closed. They have the option of referring the complaint to the Queensland Civil and Administrative Tribunal or apply to the Commissioner for an extension. What are your guys' thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments down below. I know the Americans are going to have a big field day with the very healthy freedom of speech we have in this country that is totally very real if we all just sit and believe in it, and it surely does exist, but uh, <laughs> it surely does exist. Because if Isaac is forced to apologize over one complaint to the Human Rights Commission, that will set a very low precedent in this country. Also making the rounds, do you, do you make backups of your YouTube content? Well, you should, because it could be taken away at a moment's notice. Today, Dick Masterson had his YouTube channel briefly removed from YouTube for several hours after receiving a third strike. Dick tweeted, YouTube, you guys gave me a third strike and deleted my account over a 30 second TV show clip I played off of Twitter. The second strike was for child endangerment because I played a 30 second clip of an ABC news story from their official YouTube account. He then says, these are my three YouTube strikes by the way. Number one, six fat guys lying in a pile equals nudity and sexual content. Number two, clip from the official ABC news YouTube channel about a student attacking a teacher equals child endangerment. And number three, 30 second clip from a Transformers cartoon equals copyright strike. YouTube did respond saying, looks like your appeal is still under review right now. It's best to wait until you hear back from our policy team via email. Within a couple of hours, Dick then tweeted, I'm unsuspended, thank you all, now I'm doing drugs. That's it for the news today. If you see anything around that you'd like us to report on, let us know on Twitter at Shockmails and uh, click the subscribe button if you enjoy what you are seeing here. And I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one.